Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 22nd of December 1989, Romanian communist leader Nicolae Ceausescu was overthrown. He and his wife fled the capital Bucharest in a helicopter, but after landing in a field, were arrested, tried and sentenced to death. Five days before his overthrow, on the 17th of December, Nicolae Ceausescu had ordered the military to put down a revolt in the western Romanian city of Timisoara. Triggered by government's attempts to evict an ethnic Hungarian pastor, who they accused of inciting ethnic hatred, the Timisoara uprising quickly became a broader anti-government demonstration. News of the government's crackdown was not shared in the heavily censored government-controlled press, but it quickly spread through Western radio stations such as Radio Free Europe. With the unrest spreading beyond Timisoara, Ceausescu addressed a staged demonstration from a balcony in Bucharest on the 21st of December. However, Despite the presence of the brutal secret police known as the Securitate, the crowd began to heckle him, and Ceausescu was hustled back inside the building by his bodyguards. With the speech being televised around Romania, and the video feed only being cut after the start of the crowd's response, it was clear to everyone that something monumental was unfolding in Romania. Having failed to regain control of the situation by the following morning, the 22nd of December, Ceausescu and his wife fled the Central Committee building by helicopter. However, their pilot faked a threat of anti-aircraft fire and landed. The Ceausescus were later arrested and were put on a trial, which was really a show trial, on Christmas Day. Found guilty of genocide and other crimes, including illegally gathering wealth, they were sentenced to death. They were taken outside and shot within minutes of the trial ending. <laughs>